Hey guys, Techno Mitchell with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone if the Bluetooth icon is grayed out or is not working for you. As you can see here right now, it's grayed out for me. And even if you go into the setting, you may notice if you go into settings and then click on Bluetooth, it might be turned off. You try to click on it, it doesn't turn on. So these are the steps you're going to follow to fix this problem. First thing that I recommend is whenever it comes to Bluetooth, any connectivity thing, is that you want to make sure your phone is at least 20% or more charged. When you're under 20%, certain things are limited, like Bluetooth connectivity uh, will get reduced just to save those batteries. So make sure your phone is at least 20% or more charged. Now, the first troubleshooting step is pulling down the control menu here or pulling it up if you have a phone with the home button and clicking on airplane mode and putting your phone on airplane mode briefly and then turning off airplane mode. And hopefully after that, you can go ahead and select Bluetooth and it's working and it's enabled again. Now let's say it's still not working where it's just grayed out just like that. The next thing you wanna do is a forced restart of your iPhone. So in order to do a forced restart, we're gonna press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down one after another, and finally hold this side button until the screen goes completely black. And once you see the Apple logo up here, we'll let go of that side button. So it's gonna be volume up, volume down quickly, and then I hold that side button. Now it's gonna pop up to slide to power off. You do not need to do that because that will be just a normal turning on and off. So we need to keep on holding it, so it's forced it to shut down. And then once we see the Apple logo up here, we'll let go of that side button. And all that does is shuts down the phone software and then reloads the code. So if there's a software related issue going on or a hardware related issue, it'll fix it. And you can do this as many times as you need to. If you don't get the hang of it the very first time, try it again. It's gonna be volume up, volume down quickly, one after another, and then holding on to that side button. Now, after you have done that, and let's say you're still having issues with the Bluetooth, uh, icon being grayed out. The next thing you want to check in your setting of your iPhone this time, right? We're going to go into setting of our iPhone and then we're going to go to screen time. Now you might have a screen time password. You might have to enter that, which might be different from your regular passcode. But anyways, once you're in here, you'll go under restriction for the content and privacy restriction. We're going to click on that. And now if you have this turned on, you can try turning it off and see if that helps the Bluetooth. But the setting that here that you want to check out is under Bluetooth sharing. As you can see here, we want to ensure that it's selected to allow. So if it says don't allow, right, Bluetooth will not work for us correctly. So we want to make sure it's allowed. And under app clips, if you have apps here listed, make sure they turn you turn them on so they can use Bluetooth as well. Now, after you have done that, we make sure that it's allowed. Uh, and this is good to go. The next thing we want to do in our setting here is go in the main setting, then go to general here. And then from here on, we're going to scroll down, click on transfer reset iPhone, click on reset, and then do a network reset. So if I do a network reset, basically it resets things around network connectivity. Like if you had saved Wi-Fi passwords, those will get reset. You'll just have to enter it again and it will it will not delete any of your personal data so all of your photos videos apps will still be on your phone it's just the network settings themselves things like if you connect it to a bluetooth device it will get removed you'll just have to connect it again which is fine because it will fix the bluetooth connectivity issue and if it's still not working the very last thing to do is updating your iphone by going into your settings and going to general software update and see if there's an update out sometimes a previous update might have caused the issue where uh, the Bluetooth isn't working anymore and it's grayed out. You want to update your phone to the latest iOS version. So there's a bug fix or security fix that needs to be fixed. It'll fix it and give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes whenever you're doing any software update and make sure your phone is at least 50% or more charged. And hopefully after doing that, your iPhone Bluetooth is working. And I hope this video was helpful. If so, please do consider in the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.